All right, what's up, y'all? It's Luke Thomas MY here today with another unboxing video for your viewing pleasure. Uh, today I have for you a very special treat. Uh, this is the Majora's Mask edition of the new Nintendo 3DS XL. Now this is a special treat because these have been out of circulation for a little while. Um, and the main reason that I bought these is because people online are saying that this is a model that's confirmed to have an IPS screen. Um, so to give you a little bit of background on that, there's two different kinds of screens that Nintendo will randomly put into the, the uh, 3DS. They'll either use a TN screen, which um, looks good from straight on, but when you tilt it back, like if you're trying to lay down and play like the system at an angle or something, uh, loses all of its colors and washes right out. Um, so what I'm going to do here is unbox the Majora's Mask Edition new Nintendo 3DS XL. Um, just do like a basic quick rundown of what, you know, what couple things are inside of the package here. And then I want to turn it on real quick and do a uh, screen comparison test. Like just a quick first glance, like how does this screen look versus the one that I have here that I'm 99% sure is a, a TN screen. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into it. I'm going to go ahead and pop it open. Um, I don't want to rip the box here. Be super careful. All right, so we got the box open, we slid it out. And then inside of the box here, on the first layer, we have the AR cards for the new Nintendo 3DS XL and the user manual. Now this box actually internally looks a little bit different than what I'm used to when, I, when I've opened these up in the past. Uh, that's not a bad thing. It just, uh, I guess I'm used to opening, like like the last one I opened was the new 3DS Galaxy style one. And that one kind of was like, you took out the user manual and it was right there. You could just kind of like lift it out. This one kind of seems like you have to either like fold it open first and then slide it out or un, undo this kind of like tab right here that's on the other side of the box. But I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and, and slide it out like that. I think that's maybe what they intended here. Awesome. So yeah, we got the system out of the box for the first time ever. Go ahead and... How long were they out of circulation for? I don't know exactly when they stopped making these ones, but I know that you haven't been able to find them in stores like this for a while. Mm -hmm. That is beautiful. Nice. It's got a nice shine to it. Metallic gold. You can see the all five of the masks on there. Really sweet design. I actually like it, I think, more than I thought I was going to. Up close. I think when you see it online, it doesn't really do it justice. Like, I think you have to like get up close to like appreciate the level of detail that each one of the masks has. Yeah, back here still in mint condition. As I was saying, never been out of the box. Brand new. I'll go ahead and pop this open here. That feels nice. Brand new. 3DS XL. All the buttons feel really good. The Majora's mask design on the outside. I'm going to go ahead and turn this on and see if this has some juice here. Oh, red light. No bueno. Mm, it might turn on, though. We got the orange light. Let's see. Oh, and there we go. We got some action here. Oh, yeah. That's definitely IPS. Yeah, that is. You can Maybe see it from over there, from right? Here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. It's going to be hard to tell because I'm not at exactly the same screen and because of the camera and stuff, I might have to turn the lights off in the room. But yeah, this one I just opened up here, this uh, Majora's Mask one that I got, definitely has the IPS top display. You can see uh, that from any angle, the text stays the same exact color, stays just as visible. It's kind of really hard to tell on with the way the auto brightness is set up on the camera though. Maybe I'll do another separate shot of this in a second here. Uh, just to get like a comparison, uh, I'll try to maybe clip these two videos together for you guys and uh, that way you can get a little bit of a better view on uh, the, the comparison between the two screens. 
Um, but yeah, for now, this is the unboxing portion. Uh, I'll see you guys back in a second with the uh, screen comparison portion of these of this video. I'll catch you guys in a little bit. All right, y'all, I'm back uh, with the second part of this video, the screen comparison part of the video. Now, both of these uh, 3DS XLs, these are both new 3DS XL models. Uh, the one on the right is uh, the Majora's Mask Edition that I just unboxed. The one on the left is just a standard off-the-shelf uh, black one. Um, now, if you take a look at both of these here, these are both set to a screen brightness of 5 with auto brightness off. Um, so we should have uh, similar looking uh, results on both of these displays if they were both the same type of display. But because one is going to be a higher quality display than the other, you're going to see that from uh, different viewing angles, like from down here, that the one on the right has a noticeably uh, easier to read display and noticeably more accurate colors on the thing moving around. That disc spinning around there at the bottom is supposed to be uh, green like grass. Um, so the one on the left you can see is all washed out. It almost looks kind of like bluish. The one on the right remains green, just like it does head on. Um, also, when you look at like extreme angles, you know, from the left or from the right. So here you can see once again. Um, now, obviously, I'm closer to the one on the right, so you know I'm going to show from the left angle as well. Um, but you can see that regardless of angle in this case. Um, or regardless of which one is closer in this case, you're going to see that from an extreme angle that the colors remain more accurate, like the greens remain more green, the blacks remain more black. You get less of that washed out gray color, less of that washed out on the blacks, less of that washed out uh, bluish color on the greens there, and uh, just an overall much better looking display. Um, it looks better when you're playing video games, laying down, it looks better when you're using 3D. Um, and using the, especially the head tracking 3D with the new 3DS XL. Um, so yeah, sorry for the way the focus is kind of popping in and out on the camera here. Um, I don't think the way, it likes the way that the room is dark right now. But yeah, I hope that helps you guys uh, um, distinguish between a TN display like the one on the left here and an IPS display like the one on the right there. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed what you saw in this video. Make sure to subscribe, come back for more. Um, and yeah, for now, this is Luke Thomas MY saying goodbye. I'll catch you guys next time.